Project Search. Hi, it's Danny again. Today, I have a very important presentation for you. It's about the interest inventory. During this presentation, you're going to learn about what an interest inventory is, and you're also going to start completing one. Today's presentation will have the first set of questions for your interest inventory, and the presentation for tomorrow will contain another set of questions. You're gonna need a pencil or pen and some paper to write down your answers for both today's presentation and tomorrow's presentation. And hold on to those answers. We are going to be using your answers as we figure out what type of job you want to pursue. Project Search UTMC Remote Learning Career Goals Part 3 Interest Inventory Questions 1 through 7. Interest Inventory? What's that? An interest inventory is a tool for helping people decide what careers best suit their interests and innate capacities. Interest inventories vary, but generally they consist of a series of questions about the different aspects of work. This presentation includes the first part of an abbreviated interest inventory that will introduce you to the concept and get you ready for longer, more detailed interest inventories that you will complete a little later in the program. Think of this as a practice round, as well as an opportunity to closely examine your likes, dislikes, talents, and challenges. This will be an important step for you as you determine your ultimate career goals. Let's get started. Here's what you'll need to complete this interest inventory. A pen or pencil, some paper to write your answers down. Pause the video to give yourself enough time to think about each question and answer it as accurately as you can. For each question, you will answer A for yes, B for no, and C if you don't know. Later, we will use your answers to help identify jobs that best match your preferences. There are two sets of questions in this interest inventory. The first set is in the presentation you'll watch today, and the second set is in the presentation you'll watch tomorrow. Use the same piece of paper you're using to answer the questions in this presentation to answer the questions that will be presented in the next presentation, which will be a continuation of this interest inventory. Question one. Do you like cleaning? On your piece of paper, write A for yes, B for no, C for don't know. In the pictures on the slide, I have several examples of cleaning tasks just to get you thinking about what cleaning can be. Pause the video, think about the question, and answer the best you can. Question two, do you like working with food? A for yes, B for no, and C for don't know. Once again, I have several examples of jobs that would have you involved in food in some way, whether preparing food or serving food, putting the finishing touches on a dish, lots of different possibilities there. So pause the video while you think about your answer and answer to the best of your ability. Question three, do you like reading and writing? Answer A for yes, B for no, C for don't know. Once again, I put some example pictures of tasks that would involve reading and writing. So you might type, that would be related to reading and writing, or actually write things on a pad, you have to read things from a clipboard document, read a printed document, lots of different things that you might have to do that would involve reading and writing. So pause the video and think about your answer. Answer the best you can. Question four, do you like messy tasks? A for yes, B for no, C for don't know. You see some examples of messy tasks in the slide. Lots of things that are out there that could be really good jobs, but you'd have to be able to 
tolerate getting a little messy. Pause the video, think about your answer. Question five, do you like clean tasks? A for yes, B for no, C for don't know. A lot of jobs involve tasks where you're probably not going to get messy. Office jobs, uh, stuff such as a concierge or a front room worker at a hotel or motel, uh, cashier at a clothing store, administrative assistant who does filing and related tasks. So think about that question. Pause the video and answer the best that you can. Question six, do you like putting things in order? A, yes, B, no, C, don't know. Some jobs are gonna include a lot of organizing of materials. So you might work at a retail clothing store and have to sort clothing on racks by size and style and so on. Or perhaps you get a job at a hospital and you have to stock medical supplies in a nurse server or other storage area. Pause the video, think about the question and answer the best way you can. Question seven, do you like tasks that involve a lot of walking and standing? A for yes, B for no, C for don't know. Think about the idea of doing tasks that require you to walk and stand for long periods of time. Do you think that's something that you would be happy to do? Do you think it would be a challenge? So pause the video and answer the question the best you can. Now keep that piece of paper, not only because it's gonna be used later when we're helping you do your job search, but also because tomorrow's presentation will include several more questions that you're gonna to add to that interest inventory. It's really exciting to think about the prospect of you all going out there a little later on, searching for jobs. And this is a really important part of that, figuring out what really is best suited to you and where you're gonna have the best chance for being happy, satisfied, and successful.